I think the way you play it, especially if you're a retail investor, you should go buy the, the hyperscalers that you, that you can see are putting up, and they're gonna dedicate massive amounts of capital to this space. We really don't know how you compete against those giant hyperscalers. The race for AI dominance is heating up and investors everywhere are scrambling to figure out how to profit from it. But according to Mitchell Green, founding partner of Lead Edge Capital and longtime tech investor, most retail investors are looking in the wrong place. His message is blunt. Stop trying to pick the next open AI or Anthropic. The best way to play AI isn't chasing private startups with massive dilution and unclear long-term winners. It's by owning the hyperscalers. Green's reasoning is hard to ignore. The trillion-dollar giants, Microsoft, Amazon, Google, and Meta, are spending tens of billions each year to build AI infrastructure, acquire top talent, and integrate AI deep into their ecosystems. Amazon's AWS, Google Cloud, and Microsoft Azure aren't just riding the AI wave they're building it. And unlike early stage AI companies that rely on endless fundraising, these hyperscalers have the capital, market share, and distribution to turn AI into sustainable revenue growth. This perspective comes at a time when markets are walking a fine line. Interest rates remain high, inflation pressures persist, and geopolitical uncertainty has injected volatility into equities. Yet big tech continues to post strong earnings and funnel unprecedented investment into AI, a sector Green says is still in the 1999 internet stage. The winners may not be fully clear yet, but the infrastructure leaders have the best odds. In today's video, we'll break down three hyperscaler stocks perfectly aligned with Green's view, unpack their latest moves in AI, and see why this strategy could be the most powerful and underappreciated way to play the AI revolution. Let's begin with Alphabet Inc., ticker symbol G-O-O-G-L, a company that has quietly transformed from a search engine powerhouse into one of the most diversified technology giants in the world. Its Q2 2025 results showcased why it belongs at the center of any conversation about the AI revolution and the hyperscaler opportunity Mitchell Green described. Alphabet delivered nearly $96.5 billion in quarterly revenue, up almost 14% year over year, with profits and cash flow surging across the board. While Google Services, Home to Search, YouTube, and its vast advertising network remains the primary profit driver, the real growth engine right now is Google Cloud. This segment posted an impressive 31.7% revenue jump to $13.6 billion, with profits more than doubling year over year. Cloud is where Alphabet is making some of its most aggressive investments, earmarking $85 billion in 2025 capex, much of it for AI-driven data centers. With the global cloud market projected to hit $2 trillion by 2030, Alphabet is perfectly positioned as one of the top three providers alongside Amazon AWS and Microsoft Azure. But Alphabet's growth story doesn't stop with cloud. AI is deeply embedded across its ecosystem, from Gemini, its flagship large language model, to AI-powered ad targeting that keeps its advertising engine strong. YouTube continues to expand with new ad formats and rising brand spending, while Google Search maintains its dominance despite competitive AI chat interfaces. In today's macro environment, with high interest rates, inflation concerns, and geopolitical uncertainty, investors are seeking companies with both resilience and runway. Alphabet offers both. It has the capital to fund massive AI and cloud investments, the customer base to monetize them, and the scale to outlast smaller competitors. This is exactly why Green calls hyperscalers the best way for retail investors to play AI. Alphabet isn't just adapting to the AI era, it's helping to build it, and that's a position few companies in the world can claim. Next on the list is International Business Machines Corporation, ticker symbol IBM, a company that has been quietly redefining itself for the AI era and, in 2025, has managed to outpace even the biggest hyperscalers in stock performance. Its Q2 results were a clear reminder that this is not the slow-moving big blue of the past. IBM delivered $17 billion in quarterly revenue, up 7.6% year-over-year, handily beating Wall Street expectations on both revenue and earning. What's driving this surge? A combination of AI-driven innovation, robust demand for infrastructure, and steady growth in its high-margin consulting and software businesses. The standout surprise came from infrastructure, IBM's launch of the Z17 mainframe in April, designed to handle secure enterprise workloads and AI applications, 
ignited a massive 43% sequential jump in infrastructure revenue. Large banks and enterprises are upgrading faster than expected, attracted by the promise of running AI securely on-premises. Consulting also showed signs of recovery, with a growing backlog and the biggest sequential revenue jump in nearly four years, signaling that IBM's hybrid cloud and AI advisory services are gaining traction despite a cautious macro backdrop. Software, led by Red Hat and IBM's open-source AI platform, continues to grow in the mid-teens, cementing its role as the company's long-term growth engine. While it fell slightly short of analyst expectations, the momentum in hybrid cloud adoption suggests that demand is far from slowing. Margins tell the other half of the story. IBM posted one of its highest gross margins in a decade at 58.8%, and operating margins expanded significantly. In an environment where interest rates remain elevated and tech valuations are under constant scrutiny, IBM's disciplined execution, strong free cash flow outlook, and proven ability to monetize AI investments make it stand out. This is why, even after a post-earnings pullback, many see IBM as positioned to keep outperforming. For investors looking beyond the obvious hyperscaler names, IBM offers a compelling AI plus infrastructure play with staying power in the years ahead. And finally, we have Tencent Holdings Limited, ticker symbol TCEHY a company that's been quietly re-accelerating growth and using AI as the fuel to power its vast digital empire. For years, Tencent has been a household name in China, dominating gaming, social media, and digital payments. But after a regulatory crackdown and a slowdown in 2022, many on Wall Street wrote it off. Now, the company's latest results suggest that might have been a big mistake. Tencent just posted its strongest growth quarter since 2021, and AI is at the heart of its revival. Gaming, Tencent's crown jewel, is roaring back. Domestic gaming revenue surged 24% and international gaming climbed 23%, driven by AI-powered innovations in player matchmaking, personalization, and content creation. These enhancements are keeping gamers engaged longer, boosting in-game spending and cutting production timelines. Flagship titles like Honor of Kings are thriving again, while new launches such as Dungeon and Fighter Mobile are gaining traction fast. Then there's WeChat, Tencent's all-in-one social and commerce platform with 1.4 billion monthly active users. AI-enhanced ad targeting in WeChat's video accounts and mini programs drove a 20% jump in ad revenue, while new AI features like the Yuanbao chatbot have seen engagement skyrocket. With AI tailoring experiences and recommendations, every new feature becomes stickier and more monetizable. Tencent Cloud is the third pillar, tying everything together. CapEx nearly doubled as the company builds AI-ready infrastructure, positioning itself alongside Alibaba in China's cloud race. Its Hunyuan model is already powering both internal and enterprise AI solutions, creating a flywheel effect where AI strengthens Tencent's core businesses and those businesses, in turn, fund further AI growth. Despite regulatory and geopolitical overhangs, Tencent's valuation remains modest at around 17 times forward earnings, a steep discount to U.S. tech peers with similar growth. With buybacks at record levels, gaming momentum restored, WeChat monetization accelerating, and AI becoming an embedded growth engine, Tencent is shaping up to be one of the most overlooked AI plays on the global stage. This is a company not just riding the AI wave, but building it into every layer of its massive ecosystem.